Hello, lesson one in algebra is called the complex numbers. What is the meaning of complex number? Let's see an example. Find the solution set in real numbers. What is the meaning of real numbers? Real numbers mean rational number and irrational number. X power two plus nine equal what? Equal zero. Who can find this solution set of this? x power 2 equal negative 9. Is it right? x equal positive or negative root negative 9. We said before we can't find root by negative. So here the solution set will be equal what? Will be equal 5. But we want to find a solution for finding the answer with negative under the root. How we can find the answer under the root by negative? Let's see. Negative 9. Can I make it negative 1 times 9? Is it right? I can make it. All of us know the root of 9. Okay. Negative 1. Negative 1 equal another symbol. We will see it again. i power 2 equal negative 1. When I see negative 1, it's equal i power 2. What is the meaning of i? Imaginary number. Imaginary number. Okay, so I will cancel negative 1 and put i power 2. Now we will find the answer positive or negative. Root i power 2 equal i root 9 equal 3. So the result will be positive or negative 3i. Here I find an answer in imaginary number. This is called, and this number is called complex number. A number with letter I is called complex number. So use complex number to find what? To find answer for the negative under the root. Okay, if I have I power 12, I power 12 equal what? The first thing I will make the power in table 4. Why? Because I have, if I say i power 2, i power 2 equal negative 1. If I wanted to find i power 3, it will be i power 2 times i. And we have i power 2 equal negative 1, so negative 1 times i equal negative i. i power 3 equal negative i. i power 4 equal i power 2 power 2. And i power 2 equal negative 1. So negative 1 power 2 equal 1. So my rule model here, i power 4 equal what? 1. Now I will use it to find i power 12. i power 12, I want to make it in table 4. It will be i power 3 times 4 equal 12 times i power 0. There is no remainder. There is no remainder. Okay, I will cancel it i power 12 equal 1. Why i power 12 equal 1? Because this number is multiples of 4. Multiples of what? 4. Now, i power 101 is 101. Multiples of 4? Let's see. I will search about the nearest number in table 4. How I can find it by calculator? I will make this number divide 4 to the remainder, to still have remainder, or make 101 divide 4 in calculator. I will make what? 101 divide 4 in calculator. The answer will be 25.25. So it will be, I will take the whole number, which is what? Which is 25. It will, I will put it what? 4 times 25 times i power. 4 times 25 equal 100. I have remainder from 101, 1. This is cancel. It will be equal 1 and i power 1 equal i. So the answer of i power 101 equal what? i. Again, can we take another example? 12 i power 12 times n plus l3 i power 12, this is number multiples of 4, so it will be 1. So I have still i power 3, i power 3 equal negative 1. We said it before, how we can find it. It's y power 2 times i 
i bar 2 equal negative 1, so negative 1 times i, negative i. Now I want to answer i power 1 over i power 19, or I can say i power negative 19. So when I see a number like this, i power negative 19, I will put 1 over i power 19. I will replace 1 by i power, a number of multiples of 4 nearest to 2, 19 or greater than 19, which is what here, 20. So i power 19, or i power 20. I will make minus for the power i, 20 minus 19 equal 1. So the result i power 1. Now I want to find the answer of i power negative 60. I power 60, I power negative 61, it will be 1 over I power 61. So I will find a number I power what nearest to 261 in table 4, 64. And here I power 61, I will make to the power minus 61, 64 minus 61 equal I power 3. All of us know I power negative, I power 3 equal negative I. So the result will be negative I. We can write the complex number as in this form, a plus b i. Example for complex number 13 minus 2 i, 7 plus root 5 i, negative 25, 8 i, root 15, 5 i minus L4. Let's take this example, 2 i times 1, it will be what? When I have a number times the bracket 2 i times 1, it will be 2 i. 2i times negative 3i, 2 times negative 3, negative 6, i times i, i power 2. All of us know that i power 2 equal negative 1, so it will be 2i. Negative 6 times negative 1, positive 6. I will write that number in the complex way for the, uh, writing the number 6 plus 2i. For example, let's take a, a number. 30 plus 45i over 1 minus 2i. We can't find answer if I have imaginary number in the denominator. So we will make multiply by the conjugate. What is the meaning of the conjugate? Conjugate of 1 minus 2i. We change the sign of the imaginary number. It will be 1 plus 2i. This is what? This is the, a, the conjugate of this number. So we will make 30 plus 45i over 1 minus 2i times the conjugate 1 plus 2i over 1 plus 2i. Let's find the answer. The 2 denominator, it will be what? 2 brackets with different sign. It will be the first number power 2, the second number power 2 and negative. Here I will make times what? 30 plus 45i times 1 plus 2i. The denominator will be what? 1 power 2 equal 1 minus 2i power 2. It will be 4i power 2. How we, will make, how we can make times for the two bracket? First time is first. 30 times 1. 30 second times second, 45 times 2 equal 90i power 2. The middle term means and extremes. It will be 45i times 1, 45i. 30 times 2i, 60i. It will be 105i. 105i. Okay. So how we can find the answer? i power 2 equal negative 1, it will be negative 90. So the answer will be 30 plus 105. i minus 90 over i power 2 equal negative 1, negative 1, negative 4 times negative 1 plus 4. So the result will be 5. 30 minus 90 equal negative 60 plus 105. i. All these numbers divide by 5. Let's take negative 60 divided by 5 equal negative 12 plus. I will make 105 divided by 5. It will be 21. So the answer will be 21i. And that's all. Bye.